Here we go, jumping into it. Grand finals, best of five. Bane's got to reset this to beat Jeff. Yeah. And if you were following along earlier, I believe Jeff did take him and down and put him in the losers against me. So here we go. All right. Yeah. Oh, and they picked training stage for grand finals. The best stage in the game. Okay. So something Bane had going on last match in the Sim is Sim's got stellar anti-airs, but they're very situational. Yeah. He was picking the wrong anti-airs at different jump ranges, and Jeff was catching on to that. So hopefully ah. he can fix that. Right. Yeah. I, I was noticing that too. Uh, he was picking the wrong anti-airs, or he's picking the wrong timings for anti-airs. Exactly. Yep. He's got great. He's got great V reversal timing. Oh, with punish. Oh, does a punish? Cool. All right. Yeah. Oh boy. That Dawson float, the bait of baits. He wants you to move forward. He wants you to push buttons. I think really between these two, the winner will be the one that doesn't lose their cool. Right. Um, yeah. Especially with Lara on the scene. Jeff's Lara especially. He's got all the scumbag, all the dirty tricks, right? <laughs> right. So if you let him in, you're going to pay for it. Oh, okay. All right, all right, all right, all right. Much cooler head from Lord Bane. I don't think I met you, by the way. Uh, Bryce. Tom, good to meet you, my dude. Yeah. Oh, good whip punish. Just trying to get those wiggles in. Not letting it happen. Set up. Ooh. Disrespectful. Three dashes. Just trying to prove a point here. Good anti-air. Oh, 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 oh. Jeff wising up, he's not moving in on those those things. Right. Chasing him down. Gets the command grab there. Doesn't interrupt the dash. Oh, oh the meaty works. Okay, time to guess. 50-50. Alright. Alright. Hold up. Nope, get nope, like it's done, and that'll be the end of the round. Right, that big boy damage from Lara. I guess yeah. big girl damage, I should say. Oh yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that's that, that positioning so scary because like you want to jump out of her command grab, right? Uh huh. But she still gets that mini light kick. You're gonna pay for it if you hold up. Right. So it, it's a pure 50-50 moment there. Oh, love it! Just inside the fireball range, gets the low forward confirm. Oh, nice! Low profiles it. All right, Bane, let's go. Yep. There we go. Oh, good. He's got his anti-airs back. So one of the things that sim players will complain about is that his anti-airs don't always discourage you from jumping, right? Because uh -huh. it's a jab. You're not taking a lot of damage for jumping right. in. Ooh, nice. Interrupts the command dash. Oh, doesn't get the link. That's one game for Lord Bane. Yep. He seems much calmer in this match. Jeff seems to be trying to get in and close it out. Yeah. Bane's very comfortable playing keep away, which I really like to see. Which... Straight back to rematch. Oh, they're just going yep. in. No one wants to take a breath. They just want to fight. Nope. That's why we play fighting games, right? Push buttons? <laughs> just push buttons. That's why I play fighting games. Pick a character, let's push all the buttons, and you're a happy person. I can't say much. The character I play in Blaze Blue is basically a just push buttons character. So, so as, as someone who doesn't know much about Blaze Blue, that seems like if I wanted to push a lot of buttons, like Unist, uh, Uniel, uh -huh. Blaze Blue, like those would be games to play, right? Like those are button games. Oh, yeah. Which isn't bad. They've got those sick air dash combos. Oh, that was dope. Oh, Read the back dash and slid in. Yep. And now yep. he's out of the air. Now it's Lara time. He's got to hold all this. Why isn't he V-reversaling? Okay, okay. I like that. All right. Um, probably just trying to save that V-reversal for, you know, he has the pressure on, but he, d he doesn't need to use it at the moment. He wasn't stuck in the corner. And true, he, true. he did get the punish on the end of the block string. That's so. fair. I, just, I find it impressive against Lara's because she has so many frame traps, so many right. situations to put you in a bad spot. Usually, usually, be reversal as fast as possible. Oh, interrupts the dash. It's another scary situation. Lars plus some amount of numbers, like a billion right there. <laughs> so, yeah, pushing a button there, scary yeah. stuff. Whoop. So, is Blaze Blue tag out yet? Or is that on? Uh, no, that'll be coming out at the uh, Japan end of May. Us begin July. Begin July. Yep, yep, yep. So. Just in time to practice a little bit and take a Devo, huh? Yep. Two months to practice it. Oh, good point. Oh, we missed the punish on that. Lara's minus seven. You cannot miss those punishes against her. Okay, now it's a setup. Goes this side, gets it. Yes. Oh man, that gray life peeling away a lot of extra damage. Oh. Oh. 
Oh, she oh. gets the meaty there low we fears. Go. That's 2-0, Lord Bane. Yeah. Well, we saw Brooklyn Express kind of in this situation Dolphin. on Winter's side, too. Yeah. In Winter's Finals. He was able to then kind of just adjust. He took a moment, took a breath, saw what Lord Bane was doing, and adjusted. So... Yeah. And I, I would like to see more of that. I feel like in the last match, he, a lot of one of his adjustments I saw, and maybe yeah. you saw something different too, was stepping back a little bit. So when he was hitting moves like his uh, her stand roundhouse, which is minus four, right? He was being he was at a range where even if it was blocked, he could buffer light kick, which messed Bane up quite a bit, put Bane in a bad spot. Yo, Chat's been looking for you. That's good, my dude. <laughs> of course. Ooh. Also, uh, game's probably still on Dragon Ball. I'd... Ooh, well, down fierce. You did change it. Okay. Trying to bait that out with fireballs. Here we go. I don't know if any of your mods are around. <laughs> Jump fierce. Oh, all right, here we go. Knee cancel. Okay, doesn't get the juggle. Now it's time yeah. to. Oh, good. Get the punish. Very good. Yep. Oh, really? He really likes that throw bait, right? Yeah. He's got uh, Jeff to the point where he's not. Goes doing buttons. well, by the way, guys. He's uh. He's walking around talking to everyone while we're going through grand finals here. So, was 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 there a word that he was not doing well? Oh no no, he just asked how he's doing. Oh word word word. Yeah, Hermes is a beautiful beautiful man. Oh, okay, stop that dash after stand fierce. Oh, just harassing with that roundhouse. Oh yeah. Oh okay, gets out of the corner. He's got better positioning. Jumps his normals. This is where the downfall really started during the last match was. Jeff was jumping that stand medium kick quite a lot. Oh, yeah. Oh. And just like that, he, he gets the jump in read. Um, and is now it's just inside the range. Yep. And you can't like you can't miss anti-airs against Laura like this. Because especially as Dalsim, right? You don't yeah. have any get off me. You've got no DP. All you have is your V-reversal and a teleport away, which can be crush countered if it's done wrong. So, right. Yeah. Once Laura gets in, oh, dash up sweep. Dang. He's ready for those normals now. Oh, there it is again. You see that roundhouse with the buffered light kick after just yep. outside of uh, Dalsum's limb range. Ooh, okay. EX. Oh, good, good, good. Yep. And the, he's now got him in the corner, which is huge at this point. Uh, bad anti air timing again. Jeff changing up those buttons when he jumps in. Yep. Okay, time to guess. Oh. Guess EX, two EX command three, grab. Right. Yeah. I felt like it was going to be the EX command grab because Jeff's probably feeling himself at this point. Somebody over watching tell Bane to chill out. Someone go give him a hug. Laura wins. No. Uh oh. Plug this in from the top there. Ugh. You can unplug unplug the uh, headset. It's the one with the braided cord. The braided right here? Or this one? That oh, one. the braided claw? Yep. Yeah. Some's acting up on my keyboard USB. Tap that bad boy up. Yep. Oh, wrong one. Pointer is confusing. There we go. <laughs> yeah, sorry. No, it's all good. I've had people complain about it, but I, I like it. You know what? Like, it's your PC. If you use it, who cares? Yep. If they don't like it, they can get their own computer. Good throw tech. There we go. Yeah. Finally getting those ant hairs. Good dive kick to keep pressure. Someone else bring $3,000 worth of equipment for <laughs> <Right>. this. Right. <laughs> all. Anyways. All right, here we go. Oh. oh, just outside that grab range. And no anti air there. He's afraid yep. of the jump fierce. Come on, you can re I really would love to see a reset here. Um, I think it would be a big victory for Bane. Right. So, for those that are watching that maybe don't follow the 801 scene as much, I don't know if there are people that way, but there's a large group of us on Street Fighter every Wednesday night. Uh, Bane and Jeff being two of them, right? Okay. So, these guys get a lot of game time together. So, And as of right now, Jeff is predominantly, Brooklyn Express has predominantly dominated this matchup. Okay. Um, oh, here we go. Let's see what he gets, okay? Oh, he's getting the throw baits. Oh, just that jumping overhead again. Yeah, I feel like he's back into muscle memory. He's hitting medium kick to get space, but he's hitting it just out of habit without thinking about yeah, he's where not, he is. He's not thinking about when it, And there's the anti-air that we're looking for. Yep. See, and I think from that jump, he should start using back fierce. Use Amble. Get that, get that big crush counter. Right. If you're going to discourage a Galar from jumping, you've got to peel life away. All right, here we go. One, two, one, reset. Man yep. I don't want to sound like a Walter Cronkite, but that's the way the cookie crumbles. Yeah. Laura wins. 
So we are at 2 2. I think it's cool that people are sticking with Lara. I feel like there was a large outcry in the 3.5 patch of Lara. Oh, was yeah, dead. well. It didn't help at all when Strider was like, I'm done playing her, she's right. she's for fun only now. But man, Colleen, like, I mean, his switch to Colleen makes a lot of sense. She has wonderful normals. Right. Oh man, hold those. Alright, there you go. Alright. Good buffer and a medium punch at shoulder. I don't know the official name of that move. There we go, alright. I'm also not seeing a lot, there we go. There, I was about to say, I'm not seeing a lot of overhead gale pressure. There it is. Not overhead, but gale. Uh, okay. Okay. Good try to throw it. Yeah. Nice, there we go. Yes, he doesn't need to hit as many normals as he's been hitting. Like, he's giving... There we go. Just buffering go. normals to keep him out would be much better than hitting... Oh, get that punish! There we go. Beautiful punish now. Oh, I oh. like that. I think he was actually going for a... Uh, was it down forward strong, which is... Or down forward... Down forward medium kick, which is Dalsim's uh, low. Nice. Yep. There we go. He's found those anti-airs. Now we'll see if Brooklyn Express has a response to this. Uh, the quick teleport back in response to the ag aggressive rough dash and pressure early on. Ooh, I like that. It's interesting he's not react. Generally, when you jump in against a Simmons floater like that, they'll hit medium punch and push you out. Yeah. There we go, getting those anti airs. Now that his anti airs, he's forcing. Brooklyn to play the, air, play the ground game. Yep. Man, that medium punch really did get buffed, didn't it? Laura's? Oh, um, Sim. Crouch medium punch. That anti air used to not be as effective as the down. Alright, you just gotta do this to reset. Oh, okay, here comes the mix up. Oh, good teleport away. Yeah, teleport getting out of that mix up just by using the teleport in general there. Brooklyn Express does not want to lose pressure here. He needs, he needs, oh, that should be the match. Oh, he misses the punish. Oh. This could be bad. Yep, he's got to stay press. strong. Forcing it, use the V reversal, get out of the corner. Oh, come on, my boy. Yes, there we Look go. That That's a reset. It is indeed. Dalton wins. I'm not saying anything about this. I don't want to commentate or curse my boy. I'm gonna stay nice and calm. I'm gonna try to maintain an air of professionalism here. All right, taking a moment, breathe. As you should. As you should. It's a well-deserved breather there. Oh, double dash. All right, get the punish. Yep. Brooklyn Express really seems to like to start opening up with that now. Um, just to try to get that get in really early and get that initial uh, pressure. Yeah, and I'm not sure why he's like he's doing like the so he's doing the default lower thing to go straight to overhead off the command dash. Yeah, which is not. Yeah, like a lot. And I'm not sure what he's trying to catch there. Maybe he's trying to establish an overhead game to start getting some lows. But I feel like yeah. at this point, Lord Bane has proven that he will block your overhead. Um, right. I I wonder if he's trying to uh, trying to do some conditioning of he's going to go for the overhead. He's going to go for the overhead. And then that one time where he doesn't do it is that one time that's necessary. Yeah. Good jab buffer against yep. that dash. Lord Bane is really finding it. Oh, getting a little neck massage there in the top corner. Just changes gamer tag to Big Pimpin' over there. <laughs> oh, he hurt boxes. <laughs> His leg wasn't even out there anymore and he still got hit. Yep. <laughs> oh, all right, all right, all right. Oh, good. That was minus four. That should have been a better punish. Good anti-air. Oh boy. Okay. That was a really good confirm from Brooklyn. Nice. Now he's like, now nah, I know what you're gonna do. I'll just push a big old fierce. Okay. Oh. Ooh. Throws Finally. The, throws the beat reversal. Nah, you're not nice. gonna pressure me. Get off me, bro. Oh. Oh, it's so much damage. Yes, it is. And now it forces Brooklyn to be more in the corner. But Jeff's doing a really good job just playing very patient, um, waiting for an opportunity. Yeah, he is. I like I like the adjustments he's made in this set so far. Oh, that's it. Very good. Beautiful. Lord Bane taking game one of the reset. 
looking very strong for this. Yeah, he's definitely... I mean, he's come a long way as a player just in the 801 scene. Yeah. Um, I think the last Ram Bat, he ran into Ida Peru and actually took some games off Ida Peru. Like he's, getting, he's made some huge progress, and that's really cool to see. Oh, that's good. Especially as somebody who's, you know, playing with him since launch. It's nice to see him making those moves. Yeah. Okay, slow those buttons down a bit. He's gonna start trying to jump those. Okay. Just mistimed that anti air. Alright. Gets it. Oh, yeah. Like that frame trap, not respecting the stand light. That should be stunned. Oh, nope. Still a little no. bit left. Alright, there we go. That was a good. That was, that was the kind of momentum Lara to thrive on, right? Yeah. I don't want to get that train rolling. Get you making mistakes. Ooh. With the crush counter. This might be stun. Good view reversal. Yeah. Get out. Get out. Get out. Get rid of that stun meter. I think that was supposed to be a crouch medium punch. Hit jab instead. He's a little bit flustered. Ooh, yeah. See, so jump instead of anti airing. And there it is. Game two, going to Brooklyn Express. Yeah, yeah Bane just looked like he got a little flustered Laura there. Um, Brooklyn was able to kind of get the ball rolling. And, yeah, yeah. Uh, it just, I think it shook him a little. Nope, I think you're right. And I think, you know, Brooklyn Express did change some of his uh, his button timings a little bit. He was right. staggering some buttons there. And I think it just kind of caught Bane off guard. Taking a moment, thinking about what, what just happened. What can he adjust? I had a little head nod right there. See, that's like he's processing. He's like, oh yeah, I got hit by that cheeky reset. Probably shouldn't go, probably shouldn't uh -huh. get hit by that every once in a while. Wow, just dashing in. Broken Express wants to be in there. I love it. He's oh, like, yeah. if, you, if you won't let me in, I will get in. Ooh, roundhouse. Ooh. Just out of range to confirm that. Yeah. A lot more active. Ooh. Oh, good, good Sand Pierce. He's not falling for those raw teleports anymore like he no. was in the first set. Ooh. Nice, good challenge. Good anti-air. I think without Grey Life, that trade would have been in Brooklyn Express's favor, but it looked almost even because of all the Grey that sent right. up. Right. Well Brooklyn's just looking to punish any little any move extension with those lights there. Um, yep. oh, both yeah. both players almost looking like they're kind of just uh, doing a button check at this point. <laughs> <laughs> right? There he goes. Good there throw. What's his setup? Oh, no setup. Just stays back. Keeps the corner. I like it. Make him work out of the corner. Yep. That's a mentally stressful position to be in as a Lara player. Ooh, Ooh nice teleport. Getting out of that mix up. Okay, he's going to go for another one. Okay. Nice. nice. Stop that command dash. Get the low. That command might be dash. it. Oh, 10, 10 seconds, seconds to go. And Brooklyn's gone. His health back. Oh! oh. oh. Teleport overhead. Beautiful. Ooh. That timer's <laughs> counting down. Who wins in that situation? Who has the most um, health? I don't know. I couldn't see the pixels. I think. Well, well that's why I'm wondering is, like, pixel wise, I think they were down to, like, end of their health, so... I think Brooklyn had a little bit of gray life, so I think he would have won the match otherwise. Okay. By timer scan. I, but I, I can't be sure. Yeah, it was so close to that situation. That's that boring old sim game. There we go. I like that throw. Get the low. Oh. I like, I like that. You try to push jab to stop the dash. Instead, gets hit by the low forward. Right. Good interrupt to the command dash. Oh, there we go. I feel like that's one of the strengths Brooklyn Express has as a Lara player. Not only does he have good reads, um, he adapts quickly, but I feel like most Lara's have a very predictable pattern of when they're going to command dash against you. Okay. And so you can kind of just predict it and start, you know, jab punishing it. Uh, I feel like Brooklyn Express really mixes it up well. Yeah. Um, you know, if, if he if he's doing stand jab in the command dash and you're stopping that, he'll start doing low forward in the command dash. He'll do stand fierce. Like, he'll really mix up the buttons to throw your timing off oh, that, and, through the teleport. And that's good. It it definitely is something that you can see Ooh, okay. that Jeff's been playing for a long time to be able to be able to get okay. those mix-ups. Super. Wake up super. What's the mix-up? Wake up Going super. Oh, he didn't have the super slide. anymore. Catches that micro walk back with the low slide. Yeah. Lord Bane is on tournament Dolphin point. Win.
Round one. Fight. Oh, okay, dash up sweep. So he's back to being a lot more aggressive, moving forward, trying to get up in Dalsum's face. Yeah, and oh. that's where he wants to be. Is is to get is to try to get Lord Bane to Ooh. say get off me and then punish to get off me. Yep, exactly. And I think too, you know, Lord Bane loves to buffer, stand medium kick, stand fierce. He likes to push you back with those normals, right? Right. Like all Dalsums do. And I think being able to jump those is a lot easier to close range like that. That was a lot oh. of plus frames. Yeah. It's all right. That was a lot of round. All right. Lord Bane's just got to take a moment, oh. shake that off. Yep. Not let that just rush yeah. down, lower around, uh, shake him. Agreed. Okay, moving forward. Yep. Ooh. Oh. Brooklyn, like, those stretchy limbs. Yeah. Brooklyn's okay. just doing a good job. He's, he's throwing out those lights saying, I know you're looking for it. Yep. He's like, I know you're trying to push me out with those limbs, and I'm trying to hit those limbs. Yeah. With my big old buttons. Oh, here we go. All right, this is it. Good, oh. good patience, good block. Yeah. Okay. Gets the reversal. reversal. Yep. Yeah, now we're going to get some pressure here. Yeah. There's, there's the mix-up. Wow, look at that. that. Yeah, I feel like in that situation, sliding out of the corner would be much better than trying to anti-air it. Yeah, because you want to just get out of the corner at that point. Yep. Well, and I think Dawson's crouching light slide is fast enough that you can actually get a full whip punish. Mm. Uh, cast some landing frames if you do it quick enough. Yeah. And I think for Dawson, believe it or not, with enough meter, Dawson can make you hold a lot of plus frames in the corner. Right. Okay, he's talking him. Yeah. Get a little little bit of coaching right here at the end. Yep. See, I'm definitely one of those people that's like, I don't mind you coaching. It No nah, man. I so I do mind if it's like if tournaments are running hella long. Yeah. I'm not sure if I'm allowed to say that word on the stream or not, but if tournaments are running long, you know, somebody having a thirty minute conversation before a match is bad. But you know, a two, three minute conversation if one of your boys notices somebody's tendencies, uh huh. That's part of the game to me. Yeah. So the good news is, is Blanca is electric there coaching him. He is a one of the local Blanc, uh, Lara players, so giving him some pointers. I was going to tell you to tell Bane that he needs to start sliding out of the corner instead of anti-airing, but I think you got him covered. What? Oh, that's fair. <laughs> All right, down fierce. Jeff's pulling back. Oh, there it is. Jumps the fierce. He tries to low profile the fireball with. I think he needs to stop worrying about buffering as many normals and really just hold his ground. Yeah. Hit him when it's important. Change his rhythm. Because yeah. as soon as somebody like Laura catches right there, starts catching onto your button rhythm, you're going to start eating a lot of damage. And Brooklyn just fa has found that rhythm. Um, now remember, that's the medium kick that got nerfed that's no good anymore. That was like six of those in a row. Uh -huh. Literally that button still works. <laughs> oh, damn. Ooh, There's a crush counter. I like it. Using better buttons. There we go. So I think they took it from... The standing medium? Yeah, her standing medium. So look, so this, the, the advantage on hit went to plus... Oh, when did it, this it happen? Went. This is the 3-5. Oh my, so they brought the button back. Yeah. Because originally, well, but they still increased the start up to seven frames. But if it's plus four, that's a three-frame trap. So they did bring the button back. I should have read the 3.5 notes a little better. <laughs> but looks like Brooklyn's got it right Closing here. Closing it out. I think with that long set, he was able to make enough of the adjustments and roll them down. Yep. Long Look at that, Lord Bane taking second place. Brooklyn Express is the grand champion. Yep. Taking it to the final match, almost final rounds.